Uh, hello, I'm Alejandro. I'm from Barcelona. And uh, what I do for a living is uh, I do day charter uh, on boats, on recreational boats. And also I teach for getting the licenses uh, to drive boats uh, here in Spain. I spend my free time mainly going to the gym, uh, surfing, uh, any kind of sport um, outside, outdoors. I spend time with my couple, with my pets, and that's how I enjoy my free time. I started uh, trading about seven years ago. It was thanks to a friend that used to work in a brokerage firm. So he showed me the charts, uh, how he placed trades and some indicators. And then I got really curious about it. And I started uh, checking on internet for um, how this worked, um, indicators, uh, how to open accounts, etc. Uh, for the first, first four years, I wasn't really like committed to it. I uh, was trading for a while, stopping it, losing a small account, opening a small account again. Uh, but uh, for the last three years, uh, I dedicated completely, like um, studying charge, charts uh, in a daily basis, uh, following the news, uh, doing uh, real courses, not just uh, what I could read on the internet. And, and then I, I was trading mainly on Forex and CFDs. And for the last year, I also started trading on futures on the ES and the CL. Well, so I, I mainly have uh, two strategies. One is like swing trading using Wyckoff and Elliott waves uh, for my swing strategies that uh, I apply into CFDs and Forex. And then now I'm focusing more on trading futures and for that, I mainly use uh, price action, order flow, and volume, vertical and horizontal. My, my best success in trading, I think, has been um, consistency. For the last two and a half years, I've averaged uh, 6% monthly on profitability. And yeah, I think uh, I'm really proud of that. And the worst uh, trade that I've done probably is uh, thinking that I was right uh, when my trade was still negative. So I opened a, another trade, it went wrong again, and I keep opening till I finally lost uh, five grand in a day. I decided uh, to start with the Gauntlet Mini um, first because I I knew about it thanks to my mentor in the course that I did uh, to trade uh, using order flow. He explained me about uh, these companies that you can uh, get funded by, and um, then I was checking all of them the top five, let's say, on group reviews and uh, the most famous ones. earn to trade was one of them. And finally, I saw the rules were super clear. The reviews also were good. And, and also the fact that uh, you are allowed to operate news. Not because I do uh, trade during uh, uh, the release of the news, but uh, because sometimes uh, new that is um, not very high on volatility and it's not really going to affect my trading. Maybe I already have a, one trade open. And it, it, if that rule was applied, I would have to close my trade, even if the news wouldn't affect me. So for me, that, that was a, also a strong point uh, to decide uh, opening with the uh, Gauntlet Mini. Um, so when I started, uh, obviously I used the Gauntlet at first 
to to start practicing, but uh, to do it very seriously. Like it's not the same if you just uh, put into practice what you've learned in a course uh, into a, a demo account. So for me, it was uh, doing kind of a demo, uh, but were more, way more seriously. And at first, it was complicated for me to adapt uh, the number of contracts that I was uh, opening to the real balance of the account and the drawdown that was allowed. Um, so at first, I had to learn that. And once I started uh, trading uh, way more slowly, just when opening just one contract for a long while, um, then uh, mistakes were fixed. So I learned that overall, the beginning, you don't have to rush. You have to um, go beyond the maximum drawdown. And after that, you can uh, accept more risks. Um, so uh, on the last days uh, of my evaluation, I felt uh, way more relaxed after having a profit higher than the than the drawdown that wasn't a big change for me and after that i was just uh expecting or um waiting for the right moment to open the trade i was able to um, leave them open longer and wait for a bigger profit per trade and that made me uh fulfill the, the evaluation and uh, succeed in the 15 days. So mainly my advice is uh, don't risk too much overall at, at first. Don't rush it and wait for the real opportunities. Uh, if one trade didn't enter per one or two ticks and then you realize it was a good one just wait for the next one don't rush in opening or following the price because then it's going to go wrong and um, i think that's it basically take it slowly for the first day and once you've got a profit higher than the drawdown um, you can start using the progression ladder and opening more contracts. So um, honestly, I have a very positive review for uh, earn to trade uh, Customer service is always available. They are really clear on the replies. The rules are excellent. Uh, no uh, weird rules behind, uh, you know, behind lines. Um, and the whole process, um, when you succeed on the Gone Let Me, is transparent, honest. Uh, you sign the documents and you open the real account straight away. So everything is, is uh, completely fine. <laughs>